Hey guys, welcome back to a new video on my channel. Today we are back in a brand new game. Today we are playing Airport Sim. Now, this is a game that I got free from Keymailer, which I appreciate the key for. Uh, and we're actually going to go ahead and jump straight into this. So, essentially, we are ground crew at an airport. Uh, and we have to handle arriving aircraft, uh, which includes, like, doing their baggage, doing the stairs, or the air train. Is it called an air train or a sky train? Um, also, driving the follow me trucks and stuff like that, uh, as well as buses and things like that as well. So, let's just go ahead and jump straight into this. We'll go into new game. Game. We are gonna do scenario. We're gonna go to Vagar because I want to do the sightseeing flight um, Scenario right here. So what we have to do is handle the arriving aircraft one of which is a sightseeing flight uh, with only passengers aboard The second flight is arriving from Barcelona So um, no Barcelona. No, that is Barcelona. I don't know why I thought that was a different word. Anyway, we're gonna go and jump straight into this So let's do it all right, here we go. We are going to go straight in. So, uh, whoa! I didn't think it would be nighttime, to be totally honest with you guys. Uh, every time I've actually played this game, which is once, um, <laughs> or twice actually, uh, it's been nighttime. So it's nighttime again. Hopefully, we do see the arrivals and the departures. Um, but yeah, we have started here on the no smoking area, at the no smoking area. Um,. Which is the baggage drop-off. Interesting. Anyway, let's go ahead and see what tasks we have and see if we can actually complete them. Okie dokie. So, we've got two flights. They are both arrivals. We've got no departures. So, the flight will be landing in five minutes. Okay, and the first thing that we need to do is clear area for marshalling. Clear area from vehicles and cones. I don't know where that is. Marshal aircraft at stand number three. So, let's go ahead and find out where that is. Stand number three is literally exactly where we are. I think we need to get this vehicle out of the way. So let's do that. Oh, that might be our plane that's just landed. Okay, we need to get this thing out of the way because I believe it's in the way. So let's just go ahead and move this. I don't see why it would be in the way, but yeah. We'll just go ahead and park it over here. Next to the gate. Yes. Okay, parked up. Excellent. Jump out. And now I guess we're just going to wait for our aircraft to get here. Oh, would you look at that? It landed early. It did. It landed way early. Uh, clear, clear, clear area for marshalling. Okay, I don't really understand what that means in terms of which area I am clearing, but I think this is stand number three right here. Uh, and I guess we don't actually have to go out there and get it. I think it will be able to taxi all the way here by itself. So we'll let it just drive over here, I guess. Alright, so let's have a little look at this and see what else we actually need to do. So, we are going to need to get a GPU, so a ground power unit, for the aircraft. So, I need to probably go get one of those. We need to get the stairs. We already have stairs here. We have to unload the passengers, uh, disconnect the stairs, disconnect the GPU. Alright, this one's actually relatively easy. Um, I do... There's the stairs right there. But I do need to go get a GP, GPU? Ground power unit. Yeah. So, let's run over here and see if we can find one. In fact, that looks like one right there. Yes. Alright, so let's go ahead and get our little ground tug thingamabobby. We will jump inside, and we'll drive over, and I guess attach that thingamabobby on. Here we go. Whoop. Okay, there we go. Every vehicle in this game is somewhat automatic. Uh, and I should mention that I've got the earphones on right now. So let's turn that off until the aircraft gets nearby. Oh. Right, let's jump out. Let's have a little look at this. Connect, there we go, and get back inside, and we'll drive that over to where the aircraft's going to be. Somewhere over here. Oh, would you look at that? There's the aircraft coming in. I'm hoping you guys can see this. I'm actually going to go ahead and run out there and show you guys uh, what it looks like up close. I believe they're all A320s, uh, but I'm not entirely sure. I'm not sure at all, actually. That's a good point. I don't know. Uh, but I'm almost certain these are A320s. So there you go. This one is for Atlantic Airways. And it's got a Faroe Islands um, livery on it. That's kind of cool. But yeah, it's just driving in. We didn't need to go get a follow me car or anything like that. Uh, it knows where it's going. And the pilots do too. So that's good. Although I, I don't actually know where it's going. Uh, I feel like it needs to park somewhere around here. But uh, I would have thought it was going to go that way. But I guess it's going to park somewhere around this point. I guess. I actually really don't know. Oh, no. Okay, it is going to park over here somewhere. I have to marshal the aircraft. Okay, let's go stand over here. Press Y to enter martial mode. I don't know how this works. 
Oh, okay, right. So I direct the actual plane to... <laughs> okay, well, I didn't realize I was doing that, so I've already made it... Made a mistake here. But, um... Hopefully we will be able to turn it all the way around and at least get its front landing gear within the, the square. Here we go. So we're going to continue it turning. Okay. We're going to turn it back a little bit. Going to let it drive to the left a little bit more. And then we'll direct it straight in. I didn't get to use these flight sticks before. I've never done this. I don't know how to get it to stop. So that's going to be interesting. Um, but overall, this is actually looking pretty good. Stop! Stop! There. Is that good? Okay, I think that was good. I, I think that was okay anyway. <laughs> right. Let's go ahead and get out of martial mode if I can. I don't know how to do that. Uh-oh. I don't know how to get out of march. Oh, no. Guys? Oh, we're out of it. There we go. Cool. So, we have to chuck up the wheels, and we also have to put some cones down. So, let's get ourselves some chucks. We'll run over and put those underneath the aircraft. Here we go. Place the first one. Place the second one. Run over this side. Place those ones. There we go. And now we need to get ourselves some cones. Luckily, there is a load of cones right here. So, we're going to pick these guys up. And I'm going to try and put these guys down. So, I don't really know how this works. Yeah, I'm not sure. Um, oh, there we go. Okay, that one works. Let me go ahead and pick this one up. Hey, nice. I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. De I definitely know what I'm doing. Uh, so you only get to pick up like five cones, which is unfortunate because we need six. Let's just go ahead and put that there. There we go. Go ahead and put the next one down. Excellent. And let's get ourselves some more cones. Okay. Once we've done the cones, we need to insert the bypass pin, which I believe is in the front landing gear, but I'm not sure. Uh, and then we can go from there. So run over here. Insert bypass pin. There we go. And now we need to connect the GPU. Lucky I've brought it over, eh? All right, turn on the engine. Let's drive it over there and connect it on. Now, I think on these aircraft, it's on this side. So we'll just drive it straight over to here. And we'll see. Now, it is very dark, but there should be a panel somewhere around here. Open. Okay, is that the panel that I'm thinking, or is that a big door? I think that might be a door. I don't want that. Where's the panel at? Is it on the other side? I feel like there should be a panel somewhere around here. I'm lost. I can't really see anything, either. I need a torch. Okay, flashlight is L, guys, just in case anybody is going to do this. Uh, F to open. Okay, I do believe we are actually opening the cargo door here, which is not what we want. So let's go ahead and close that back up. I don't know. I don't know where I connect a GPU to this. Is it here? Uh, yeah, okay, that looks correct. All right, good. So let's go ahead and grab this one and shove it into there. Very nice. Okay, and let's power it up, I guess. So, power... Yep. I don't know if that's working. Turn it on. Hey, there we go. And set it going. Okay, I think that's working. Signal flight crew to stop the APU. All right, let's run back here. And we are going to tell them to stop the APU by doing this. Flight deck. APU. Turn it off, please. Thank you. There we go. So now we connect the stairs. The stairs are located over here. We'll drive it over and see if this actually works. Hopefully it does. So far, I'm actually very pleased with the way this is going. Uh, I wasn't expecting to be able to do this quite as easily as I am, I guess, as one person. Uh, but it is worth mentioning, this is a multiplayer game. So, if you want to do this with friends, you totally can. Oh, wow. Uh, how do I know when I hit it? I, I guess I'm just going to hit it. Here we go, we hit the aircraft. <laughs> um, that seems pretty weird. I don't know if there's any buttons that I need to press in order for this to work. Yeah, that's definitely not connected. We do have a third person, so we can use that. So let's lift these up. Okay. 
Is that good? I don't... I don't think so. I kind of don't feel like that's good. Uh... Oh, there you go. It's flashing. The green light on our left is flashing. So surely that means we can attach onto there, no? Let's run up the stairs and open the door and see what happens. Stairs must be attached. What? We're literally here. Lower stairs, hide support, confirm connection. Hey, there we go. Right, you had to put the supports down. They have little legs. I didn't realize. Okay, run up the stairs. And open the door. All right. Secure passenger door with safety barriers. Oh my goodness. I didn't realize that was a thing. All right, let's wait for them to unload. There should be a bunch of passengers coming off now. And I guess they're just going to walk straight into the doors over there? I don't really know. Come on, you got to go. They look really weird. Really, really weird. Anyway, uh, what is the next thing that we're going to have to do? So disconnect the stand. So disconnect the stairs. And disconnect the GPU. All right, cool. And then we've got another plane arriving from Barcelona. Where we're going to essentially have to do the same thing. Except we're going to do it with luggage this time. And it's on a different stand. Interesting. Hey, look at them go. They're all unloading from my plane. Nice. Yeah, get out of here. Silly billies. Oh, it's taken them ages, isn't it? It's taken them so long. I don't know how many passengers have actually unloaded right now. But it says 0 of 59. I think it only works when they get all the way into here. Which I'm not allowed in. I am not allowed in the gate. That's really sad. That's really sad. Okay, well, I hope you guys enjoy the warm in there. Hope you love it. All right, he looked angry. She looks happy. He looks normal-ish, I guess. All right, yeah, all right, cool. Yeah, so we just gotta wait for this. It's gonna take ages. All right, well, I suppose while we're waiting for all of those guys to actually get out of there and get into the, uh, the, the gate, we'll have a little look around. So obviously we've got some baggage cars right here. These are to load and unload baggage from aircraft. This, I don't know what this is. This must be like a refueling thing, it looks like. A refueling car. We have another GPU, ground power unit. We've got our baggage carts right here, which I've never seen. Uh, we've got another stair thingamabobby right here. We've got another tow car. I believe you can actually tow aircraft with this, but I'm not sure. I don't know whether it's just for baggage. I'm not sure. Uh, right here we have... Oh no, this must be the refueling thing. This is a refueling truck, look. That's really cool. Uh, and then this one is for loading... Um, the stuff to the galley, like, uh, foods and stuff like that. They, uh, on some airports, there are actually some of these that load, like, people with wheelchairs onto planes. Because I've been in one, which is really cool. Anyway, um, yeah. Let's go back to the airport. Airport, aircraft. And we need to close the doors, we need to remove the stairs, and then we need to remove the GPU. And that's this aircraft dealt with. Okay, so close the door once the safety barriers have been fully retracted. There we go, close the door. We can now run downstairs, get inside of this. We need to press Y so that we remove our thingamabobbies. Disconnect this and... There we go, we've disconnected, sure. I, yeah. All right, I think that's it. I think that is mission complete. Let's go ahead and park this here. Sure, I've rammed it into a wall. I'm sure that's fine. And now literally all we're doing is waiting for the next aircraft. But I guess we should wait at... Oh, no, we're not. We're not, we're not. We need to disconnect this too. Emergency stop should disconnect most of that. That's good. Grab this guy out of here. Put it over here. Press tab so that we actually get what we're doing. That's it. We're done. We have successfully completed mission number one. Hey, that's awesome. That's really cool. Oh, there's our, that our next plane. All right, cool. So they're going to need pretty much the exact same thing setting up for them. So we're going to have to do the marshalling for them so that they park, right? Uh, we're going to have to go to number five. We're going to have to put the cones in, stuff like that. Uh, do the bypass pin, connect the GPU, stairs to the aircraft, load out the passengers. 
Uh, disconnect the stairs, unload the luggage, and then do... Yeah, okay, right, cool. The luggage is the bit that I'm actually kind of interested in. So let's do a bit of a time lapse of doing the first bit, and then we'll go from there. But first, I think I'm going to move this guy over there as well, because we need it. Although, where is stand number five? Oh, it's all the way over there. All right, we got it. We got it, let's move over. At least this time it's going to be a little bit brighter too, which is quite nice. But yeah, we'll leave this over here because we will need it. And we've got all of the vehicles that we need over here as well, I think. So yeah, we'll just wait for the aircraft to get over here. Although, I will need one of those baggage things. Ah, oh, luckily there's one here. Alright, we're good. I say that, I'm actually going to go ahead and attach this one to a baggage cart as well. Because I feel like that's a good idea, so let's go ahead and do that. And then, drive it out of here? Yeah, alright. I think we only need one, right? Maybe we need two. I don't know. Alright, well, we're ready. We are very ready. Here it comes, guys. The aircraft is on its way around. Uh, I do think it has to go, like, quite far around to actually get here, so... Uh, yeah, it's, it's on the runway still. Uh, it's just gonna come this way, past the two parked helicopters, and into here. That's fine. Alright, cool. Well, we'll wait here, and then when they need the sticks doing, we'll do the sticks. Okay, so it's actually telling me that I need to open the cargo door on the front and the back. So there's the front one done. Let's go to the rear, which I guess is here. There we go. Open that one as well. And then we need to take the luggage out and I guess put it in a container or something. So let's go ahead and try and figure out how these work. I've never used one of these in my life. So let's just drive it over there. There we go. Lift it up. How do I open the door fully? How do I actually like... I need it to open more than this, because this isn't... You know? I don't know how to open the door more than that. It seems weird. Alright. Um, okay. Okay, so probably don't do this. Uh, if you're ever in charge of airport vehicles, maybe don't ram the aircraft with your... Uh... Yeah, I might have caused an issue there. I might have caused... Hey, there we go. That's lucky, isn't it? Alright, so I can open and close it, but I can't actually like seem to open it enough. Like, I don't know how to push it further open than this. Interesting. Okay, so I think there might be something on here, maybe? Question mark? So there's like an open door handle, and then I can either close or open it even more, but... I think I need to, like, push something on here that allows it to open more? I don't really know. It's not really doing it for me, I don't really understand. Because uh, right here, you can read just about, actually. So it says, move something selection valve lever to open. And hold until door is fully open. And green indicator light comes on. I don't know where any of that is. Like, it wouldn't be on the other side, would it? It'd be in here somewhere. But it wouldn't be inside the vehicle, it would be here. Unless the valve's up there. 
I don't know, it either closes? Or it opens. It closes? Or it opens. It closes? Or it opens. I don't know how this bit works. Okay, I found a control. I have found a control. We can lift and lower the door if we open up this panel back here. That is not something that I expected to be a thing, but there you go. So the back one is actually open. That does mean that somewhere back here, there we go, is another panel where we can actually open up this door as well. Okay, again, didn't realize that was a thing, but now that I found it, I will never forget. All right, there we go. So that seems open as possible. There's a green light on. So now we can actually drive this over, lift it up, and drive it in, I guess. There we go. Okay, I don't know. I've activated the belt, but I don't know which way it's going. All right, it's going the correct way. So let's turn the engine on. How do I activate the belt again? Why? Okay, let's get out. Now we do have to get inside, I think, in order to get these bags out. Oh, wait, no, wait, I need the baggage thingamabobby behind this, uh oh. Right, get inside this guy, let's go. So after all of that confusing stuff, uh, all we need to do is drive this over there now and load the bags on. That is it. Let me see from outside, okay, good. So they're gonna get dropped on the ground, unfortunately, but that's okay. I can drive over here, I can put the bags in the baggage thingamabobby, and I can start unloading more. So again, if there was more than just me, obviously I could have someone else doing all of this whilst I um, did some other stuff, or whilst I sat at the bottom and waited for the bags to come down or something like that, that'd be really cool. Anyway, that's this one done, let's go ahead and load the bags into the baggage carts, there we go. Excellent. Nice. I'm the baggage handler you probably don't want. But anyway, let's run around to the other side. Get inside here. Drive backwards a little bit. There we go. All right, cool. So, let's get outside. Run over to this guy. Get inside of this one. Reverse. And then we need to drive over to that one, which is fine because it's not that far away. So, let's try not to hit the aircraft. There we go. Oh, yikes. Okay. I'm doing some rubbish things here. Rubbish driving. But that's okay. We're at a lot of an angle. Again, that's fine. Alright, there we go. Keep that going. Keep it going. Nice. Yes. I'm unloading aircraft. This seems so weird. This feels really, really weird to be doing. Uh, a bunch of these are going to end up on the ground because I can't get out in time. I still haven't connected the stairs, by the way. So the passengers are all still on board while I'm doing this. Um, but that's fine. All right, cool. So, let's reverse out of here. There we go. Because the bags are just going to fall off anyway, so that's fine. And we just load them onto here again. So that, that's okay as well. There we go. Slowly but surely, all of the bags will be loaded. There we go. Let's load all of these bags as well as one. To, hopefully I've got all of them. Because if I don't have all of them, I don't know. We might have to cry. We might have to cry. Alright, there we go. I think that's all of the bags. In fact, I'm almost certain that's all of the bags. Nice. Alright, let's close the doors because they need to be closed. There we go, it's coming down. Excellent. I wish it wasn't nighttime all the time. It feels like it's always nighttime in this game. I don't really know why. Maybe it's so you can't see the surroundings. Who knows? All right, close that up. Close this up. There we go. Then let's go to the front. Do the same thing. Close this one. There we go. It is doing it. It's doing its job. Excellent. All right. Close the door. Close this door. And it does say unload baggage. I feel like I have. I feel like I've got all of the baggage right here. Maybe I have to take it somewhere. Okay, let's take it to the uh, the baggage building thing. I don't even know where that is. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure where that is. I think it's over here somewhere. Let's have a little look. Do 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 do. Oh, there's one. 
Okay, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and say that that is where our baggage goes. So let's grab it and run over and see if this actually works. How do I make it move? How do we... How do I make it move? Hey, there we go. All right, cool. So as soon as like the baggage goes in here, I'm assuming this one gets complete. So we've done two. There's the third one. I am now the baggage person that you don't want. Sorry, guys. All right, can I throw things? It'd be really nice if I could throw it. Oh, wait, hang on. Oh my goodness. I am that baggage man you don't want. Yes! Look at me go! Yeah! There we go, nice! Whoa, yeah! Oh, oh, shiz! No! Wait! They're books! Uh. Whoops! Alright, well, it's fine. Maybe don't throw things. Yeah, maybe don't throw things. Oh, and I could open the side this whole time. Alright, I'm not throwing things anymore. Except that one. The bags are fine to throw. The suitcases, I think, open. So let's, let's not do that. Alright, here we go. It's a suitcase and I'm throwing it. I never learn. It fell off. It fell off. There you go, right? And then one more. And then that's it. Oh, no, wait. No, don't say there's one more somewhere else. I've loaded... 11, well technically 12 Can anyone see a bag on the ground? We have actually lost someone's luggage Oh, I've actually lost someone's luggage. Oh, this is really bad actually open this up. Let's just check just in case I need to actually open the door first All right, we don't have to open it fully. Is there any luggage left in there? I don't see any left in there. Okay, cool. Let's go ahead and close this back up. Okay, good. Close close that. Close this. Maybe it's in the front one. Uh, open. Okay, open. Open that a little bit. Let's see if it's inside this one. I felt like I got all of it out, didn't I? I did. Uh-oh, we've lost a bag. We've actually lost someone's bag. Uh, I don't know what the game does in this situation. So, so yeah. Um, can I go through there? <laughs> it just goes into a wall. Interesting. Um, what do I do? I've lost someone's bag. I there is there is no bags here. There's no bags left in the holds. There's no bags anywhere. Oh, there's one. It fell off. Whoo, that's lucky, isn't it? Jeez. I was thinking that it was that smashed up one that broke everything. But never mind. Right, cool. That's going to work. The next thing is probably stairs. So let's go ahead and close this up. And then we'll do the stairs and get everybody offloaded. All right, there we go. Good. Close that. Good. Get ourselves the stairs. Excellent. Oh, don't want to be on the iPad while I'm on the stairs. Stair duty. All right, lift them up. Turn them around, yes. It'd be really cool if we got to use the bus today, but we didn't. So never mind. Is this going to... Is it flashing yet? I need to put my legs down. Is it now connected? I don't know. Are we connected? Yes, we are. All right, I'm coming up. We need to do this, and we need to do this, and then we can... Uh... What? No, I can't open it. It says that we were ready to actually connect, but apparently not. All right, I need to drive better. Hold on. Hold on one second. Drive over here. Yeah, that looks good. That actually looks really good. Yes. All right, let's go to the interior. It's flashing. Press Y. Go. Hey, there we go. Now we're connected. 
And that safety barriers must be fully retract. Wait, so I, I need to do that afterwards? Oh, maybe it was fine to do anyway. My bad. All right. Wait until the animation is finished. Drag it forwards. Drag it forwards. There we go. So now they can all disembark safely. Excellent. This video has been a bit of a poo storm, hasn't it? A bit of a shit show. But, um, yeah, they're on their way. So they're going to go into the gate. And then they'll be all unloaded. What's my next job? I think that's actually it. So we unload the passengers. We've already done the luggage. We disconnect the stairs. We disconnect the GPU. And then we're done. Excellent. All right, so whilst they're doing that, let's go ahead and bark our vehicles up a little bit better than, than this. Uh, so we need to turn our engine on. Turns out it was already on. Beep, beep, excuse me, coming through. Beep, 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 beep. All right, there we go. And we need to park it over here because that's where it belongs. There we go. Excellent. We have parked our vehicle. Nice. So there's more vehicles here. Obviously, we've got that one. We've got that vehicle and we've got the, the GPU. It's fine. We'll actually just wait. Is that everybody? No. There's a lot of people on this plane. Actually, you know what? 50 people isn't a lot. Never mind. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and say that that guy is the last one off the plane. I didn't actually count them as they came down. Uh, and there was a big gap between that guy and this guy, which is unfortunate. But I think we can probably close the door. Wait until the animation is finished. What animation? Are they still unloading? Or are we actually waiting for all the guys to get inside the building? That might be it. Interesting. All right, so we're at 49. Uh, and in a second, I guess we'll be at 50. Once that animation is finished. Yeah, the door is just closed, I think. Over there. So I guess we're almost ready to... Hey, there we go. All right, cool. Bam. Safety barriers must be fully retracted. Then we can close the door. Then we can run downstairs, get inside this, press Y. Yeah, press spacebar. No, enter? It's enter. And then drive. Oh. I think I just stole the engine. I don't know what happened there, but there you go. Stairs have been disconnected. Let's go ahead and park those in here. Yep, excellent. Parked, very good. Doors are blocked. Who parked like this? Unbelievable. There we go. Right, cool. Doors are no longer blocked. Uh, now, I guess all we've got to do is turn this thing off. Disconnect this. And whack it into there. And that is it, I think. Yep, there we go. So, game time, 42 minutes 55. It took me 42 minutes to do that with both planes. Crazy. Score lost, 200. That's fine. Your score, 417. Not bad. Not bad. Anyway, um... That is that is actually it for uh, for today in Airport Sim. Uh, thank you very much to Keymailer for the key, and I guess the developers as well, so thank you. And, um, yeah, if you guys want to see more of this game, let me know in the comments down below, especially if you want to see some multiplayer. We'll see if anyone has it. Anyway, for now, thanks for watching. See you next time. Goodbye.